I feel the need, the need for speed with today's movie, Top Gun Maverick. Hello everybody and welcome to McKegg's Movie Mayhem in association with WBBJ7 Eyewitness News. I'm your host, Ian McKegg, and if it wasn't obvious, today's movie is Top Gun Maverick. It is about how Tom Cruise's Maverick has to go back to Top Gun and teach an elite group of fighters to work on a very top secret and very high risk mission. And just to start off, off the bat, this is a fantastic movie. If you need to go watch a movie this weekend, this is the movie to watch, Top Gun Maverick. All the performances are amazing. Tom Cruise himself proves why he is an A-list actor in this movie. Miles Teller plays the character of Bradley Bradshaw, AKA Rooster, who is the son of Tom Cruise's best friend, Goose, from the first Top Gun movie. And though I was not familiar with the Top Gun movie before watching this one, I did watch it last night before going into this one. And though I thought it was a good movie, this movie blows it out of the water. And Miles Teller is the believable as the son of Goose. He looks exactly like Anthony Edwards, who played Goose in the first movie. The entire cast knew how important this movie was going to be, and so they all brought their A-game. Glenn Powell as Hangman is fantastic as sort of like the antagonist character to Miles Teller's Rooster. And again, Tom Cruise, A-list actor, proves it in this film. Also, Jennifer Conley plays an amazing love interest for Tom Cruise's character, and she is also just fantastic without being the love interest. Overall, I recommend this movie, the directing, the, the music, the acting, everything about this movie is a blockbuster movie. This is also the first movie during all of these reviews that made me cry when watching the movie. I thought Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness would have done that. No, Top Gun Maverick made me cry in theaters, and I'm not ashamed to say that. Overall, this movie is a four and a half out of five star movie, a nine out of 10 movie. If you wanna go watch a movie this weekend, go watch Top Gun Maverick. So next week, I'm going to be doing the movie review for the Bob's Burgers movie. And until then, I hope you all remember to watch movies.